Hello YouTubers and welcome to the DealsPrime.com review channel. Today we have a really special review and it's for uh, Android TV box, Android 4.4 and uh, this is going to be a first look at the prototype and it's the CS928. Yes, the CS928. Now uh, as you can see here this is actually uh, a square shape and uh, if, if you guys have seen the, the, the product link uh, on uh, DealsPrime.com it's actually pre-sale and it's actually uh, a longer uh, picture, it's like a longer box so uh, it looks like they've changed uh, the uh, the size or the or the, the whole shape of the unit. So in this review we're just going to show you the, the motherboard and uh, just the ports and just talk about this a little bit. Before we get started though I want to make sure that uh, you guys like our video. Also subscribe to the DealsPrime.com review channel and there should be a link linking to Deals Prime inside of our YouTube video description. Please make sure that the link inside the video does go to Deals Prime and uh, if it doesn't then just type in Deals Prime and then you can do a search for CS928 on the website. Okay so as mentioned before uh, this has uh, the specs have changed as well as, as uh, like not only has the shape changed but the specs have as, as well and in our description it says that uh, it has two USB uh, host ports and uh, one OTG, so micro USB. But on this, <laughs> we can see uh, it has two full size uh, USB ports here. And then on the, on the other end, it also has two uh, full size USB ports. So this is kind of uh, it's kind of reminiscent of the uh, of the uh, Ugos UT3, which is also a rock chip RK3288 uh, CPU device. Now one really special thing here that we can show you is that uh, this is the Rock Chip RK3288 chip. Now why, uh, this is a quad core chip, but why is it so special? It's because uh, basically this is going to clock in at about 1.8 gigahertz, uh, making it faster than like the all winner A10T, uh, sorry, A20T uh, octa-core and also the MTK6592 CPU. Okay, now let's just uh, show you the rest of the ports on this device. So, uh, actually, we can uh, maybe zoom in just a little bit more. So we can see that it has Kingston memory. So this looks like this is a Samsung chip here. So memory, and then uh, these are this is Kingston, 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 Kingston. So I'm not sure, let me see if I can see what it says. Uh, I'm not exactly sure. Uh, so again, uh, four full-size micro USB ports. It looks like this is the battery that you can use for, uh, that that uh, basically allows the, the device to have a, uh, the time or whatever. On this side, we can see that it has uh, the, the power AC in. 5 volt, so this is 5 volt 2 amp power. It, here's, here's the power supply actually. Um, kind of, we'll show you this at, at the end of the review. Uh, so, one DC jack, uh, let's see, one RJ45 LAN port, which is here, and this I think is the SPDIF, and then there should be a uh, Sorry, this is a 3.5 millimeter headphone jack, and this is the DC uh, port. So, it actually, let's try to put this back in the case. Now, I want to remind you guys again to like our video. Uh, also, stay tuned for part two review, where we'll uh, we'll be connecting this to the TV, and uh, we'll be shooting a, like a like an in action review. I don't want to mess up the board, so uh, I'll just leave it like this. But you can see here that uh, like the two USB ports, one, two. Looks like a pinhole, uh, a reset button here. It says reset. And then uh, the, the ports here, the port holes. And then the other two USB. And the bottom of the unit, you can see it has vents here to keep it from overheating. 
and uh, here's the Wi-Fi wi antenna as well. Okay, so th this is a 2.4 gigahertz slash 5 gigahertz Wi-Fi 802.11 BGN, and it supports LAN 100 meter 100M slash 1000M base T. So again, uh, the specs, the full specs, are inside of our YouTube video description. Sorry, uh, inside the link, which links to uh, the uh, the product description. And let me see, it, it does have a micro, it has a micro HDMI port. So let me, yeah, I forgot to mention that. So this is a full size, sorry, full size HDMI port. Okay, guys, we're about to just uh, connect this baby to the to the t to the TV, and uh, we're gonna get ready for uh, part two review. It's gonna be in depth, and then we'll also probably run like an anti two benchmark test. Here's the remote. It's kind of like the CS918, the quad core version remote, and uh, and this is the power supply. Now this is actually a UK uh, power supply, and if you're in the US or Europe or Australia, it'll come with your countries. You either well, US will come with a US style uh, uh, power plug adapter, no, like an actual um, power supply. So we have an American style and European style, and this looks like it's British. Now, if you're in Australia, we'll include a power plug adapter. Okay, guys, uh, like our video, subscribe to the DealsPrime.com review channel, and we'll be right back with an in depth review, uh, part two, and then also maybe a part three uh, anti two benchmark test review. Thanks for watching.